All right, so you're probably wondering, why is this guy wearing a hat inside? What is this stuff? This stuff is paint. I like this hat, I like the way it fits, so I'm gonna wear it. Why am I wearing a hat inside? Because I, I, I don't know, I feel like my face needs something. I usually wear my glasses, but I'm tired of the glare that I get from the lights when I record these things. So I'm just gonna wear my hat and uh, see how it goes. All right, hey guys, what's up? It's Evan J here with Rima Visual, and today we're gonna be talking about it's okay to copy people. Why am I saying it's okay to copy? Because copying, at least for me, personal experience, I find that to be the easiest way to learn something. If you have somebody that has done which, where you wanna be, where you wanna be at, let's just say that, that, that uh, you wanna be a dancer and you know a dancer that's, that's professionally dancing, what better way to learn from them than just to copy what they did to learn from them and they can uh, help you become a dancer. Same thing with this. You see a photographer that you like, you see a videographer on YouTube or Vimeo or some other platform that you like, you know, follow them, introduce those techniques to your creative process. Oh, I didn't, I didn't tell you what's going on back here. I am exporting a video. I'm exporting a video right now for my church and I figured why not use this time to make a video for you guys. When you copy people, don't, copy them and then say that this is your own original idea. That's the part that I think is not right. You can say that if this was inspired, this is my replication of this of this certain thing. I think a good example is my thumbnail for the 5D, I don't know, few month checkup. I took a picture of Peter McKinnon's McKinnon thumbnail for a 5D. I think it's either a 5D or a 6D. I actually started with that. I just recreated it, but I was like I think I want to tweak it a little bit. So then I added a backlight to it, kind of separate it, um, kind of pulled back a little bit more and made it made it my own thing. And that's something that you that you may find when you start copying someone to get an original idea. And then you're like, I think I'll add a light here. or Maybe I'll add some stone here or some texture here. or Maybe I'll say this and, and, and instead of that, you know? So that's why I think it's okay to copy, but don't say it's your original idea. Because as you copy people, you can see what things you like and see what things you don't like. And so let's say that you copy this one person's LUT, but then you adjust it to the way that this video showed you, and you put those two together, and bam, you got yourself like your own little look. At least this is something that I don't wanna worry about with myself. I don't wanna worry about my look too much right now because your look is something that you develop it's something that kind of grows with you as you grow so like i don't think my videos look the, the the videos i make now look the same as the videos when i first started youtube yeah i think they look different i think they look better do they look the way how i want them to look eh, not really but basically right now i'm just going with the flow just going with what i like adding certain presets adjusting it to what i like um, so right now, I don't know if you guys have noticed on Instagram a little bit more on my Guru Shots profile, which is at Evan J, if you guys want to follow me on Guru Shots, and my thumbnails, my thumbnails as well. I've been going through like a low light. Did you see that spit come out of my mouth? I've been going through a low light phase on my thumbnails especially. Is that going to be a thing? Is that going to be my thing? Is low light, whatever, regardless of what it is, a model, a, a car, a... Uh, toothpaste. I don't know, but right now I'm really liking low light. So yeah, that's just that's basically it. It's okay to copy. Don't worry about your look right now. Just learn as much stuff as you possibly can. All right. Um, so that's basically it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. To give this video a like and subscribe. Don't forget to hit that bell right next to the subscribe button so you can be notified every time that I upload something. And I'll see you guys next week's video. I, that was a big, that was a big one. I did it all in one breath. Are we good back here or is this, does this look like too much of a mess? Does this got, does this stuff distract you guys? Let me know down in the comments below if it distracts you. I can go through it like it's, it's organized. All of it is, is uh, pretty organized.